upcoming that little clip and this video is not sponsored by samsung or something i don't know I, i'm not a money whore so i don't actually care so right now i'm gonna edit this clip guys so before the sony vegas tutorial starts i'm gonna show you guys how to make amateur uh, quality look professional i'm filming with my samsung Al uh, galaxy alpha right now and i'm not using my where is it i'm not using my like this like 400 dollars camera because that's not actually like amateur but i'm just gonna use this footage for my actual phone um to use it as amateur footage so i'm gonna show you guys how to make professional um, so I would say let's get started. Okay guys, so as you can see we're in Sony Vegas and the clip that you just saw um, was just the intro into telling you guys what I'm going to do today. So right now in this part of the video we're just going to edit that little clip that I made with my phone with my Samsung Galaxy uh, Alpha. And this video is not sponsored by Samsung or something, I don't know, I, I'm not a money whore so I don't actually care. So right now I'm going to edit this clip as it is right now just raw and uncut just That's not nice. edited at all we're just going to edit this clip with my Samsung Al uh, Galaxy Alpha right now so we're just going to uh, make this clip look actually professional even though it's filmed with a mobile phone with a front camera um, this actually is sometimes in most cases worse than the uh, the back camera so let's get started so the first thing I'll, I always do well okay so the first thing I'm thinking in my head like okay what am I going to do if I don't have anything else on my phone to make it look good? So the first thing that pops up in my head is we're going to go to the video effects tab, as you can see. Yep, you guys can see it. Uh, you want to go to brightness and contrast. You want to drag that on top of the video track. You don't want to mess around with the brightness. Um, first of all, you can do it, but I'll just rather recommend bring up the contrast a little bit. Look what happens to the clip right now. So I'm just dragging the contrast a little bit to the right. As you can see, it looks pretty good though. And if you have like my face is like really um, bright at one side, you can also bring the brightness down or whatever. Wanna how you wanna edit this? I mean, I think the brightness. I think this looks okay, like this. That that actually looks pretty good. If you compare it to this, if you compare it from this raw uncut clip to this, that's actually a pretty big difference. So that's it for the brightness and contrast. We're just gonna close it out. And then the next thing I would say is pick some color correction. So I'm just I'm gonna pick on the color corrector, drag it also on top of the video track. And um, okay, so the thing you want to do is you can pick a preset if you want to, because I think, but I don't, I don't like using presets like this one because it's it's too red. Why, why would you pick this one? This is like too green. Why, why would you pick that one? This is too blue, orange, green, like all that kind of stuff. So you don't want to pick any of those presets. If well, that's that's what I'm saying, put it back to default. And I'm just gonna mess around with those little color mixers. I'll move it out of the way real quick. So I'll just put it like this. Okay. The side. All right. Okay. So pay attention to the clip. What happens? Uh, what I would, what I like to do is add a little bit more blue. So I'm just gonna drag this marker a little bit into the blue zone and look what happens to the footage. It actually looks pretty good though. So and I think that's the first one. It's just a little bit in the blue as you can see. This one is in the center right now. I just want to add also a little bit uh, red as you can see right here. That's that looks pretty good. And then at the bottom, I would say I will just le leave that how it is. Yeah, I'm just gonna drag in that clip um, one more time. This is the clip without any effects, raw and uncut. And if you compare it to this, it looks pretty different. So we got this one, and now uh, compare at this. This is just raw and uncut, and this is just with effects. Look how epic it is. And even though it's it's it looks pretty good for the entire clip, so let's see how it looks without effects. Guys, so before the Sony Vegas tutorial starts, I'm gonna show you guys how to make. That's the one without effects, and this is the one with effects. All right, guys. So before the Sony Vegas tutorial starts, I'm gonna show you guys how to make. <laughs> it really, it looks really epic, guys. So that's how simple it is. That's how you switch your footage from amateur to professional. No one will actually uh, will be able to tell that you have filmed with like a cell phone or something or like a iPod or whatever. So I hope this tutorial was helpful to you guys. So if you want to see more of the Sony Vegas tutorials every Wednesday at 12 p.m. PC, make sure to smash that like button down below. If you want to see more, just press the subscribe button down below. I want to thank you guys for watching. I hope this tutorial was helpful to you. Make sure to leave it in the comments down below what you think. As always, guys, thank you for the continued support and I'll see you guys next week, uh, Wednesday for new videos. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next week.
Okay, so the first thing is that you don't want to do in your car, playing around with your cell phone. Drop comments down below and I'll be more happy to make a video about it. My own clothing line through the description down below. Even if you're not a subscriber correctly and quickly, Twitter verification process, you can find a link down below. I'm done with this kind of shit. Opportunity is there. As long as you guys keep watching my videos, I will keep making them.